we'll go back to the Bogestead. So I am off work and getting dinner started. Ella is at gymnastics with Justin. I'm here home with Lily, but I've got to do just a quick little evening chore run out. I've got to get chicken eggs, check on their water, check on their food, and then I'm gonna go head out to the garden and just go check on the onions and the garlic and the grapevines uh, just to see how those are doing. Well, hello, ladies. Go check on eggs. Thank you, ladies. Right now we have all of the outside spigots uh, covered because we are in the winter months. So we just have like a one gallon jug of milk, like a milk jug, and we just fill that up with water and it's enough to fill their water up. So I'm gonna get them some water real quick and then we'll go check on the vegetables in the garden. What you doing, Bubs? Chiefers. What you doing, buddy? Well, I have not been doing very well on my seed starting and I'm so embarrassed to say that. It's just something just keeps coming up and has stopped me from getting seed started, but I have got to get seed started tonight. So I am gonna be starting some Brussels sprouts, celery, and I think I'm just gonna start peppers because we've got about, I know you're thirsty. We've got about 10, maybe 10 different varieties of peppers that we are starting and I've got to get them going um, because I've got to be ready <laughs> to get out here. Okay, probably going to do one more round of that, but let's run out to the garden. Let's go run out to the garden first before it gets too dark and I run out of filming light. So let's walk out there real quick. We still have not put the fence back up. <laughs> Seriously slacking, but literally Justin and I both are back in school. I'm getting my bachelor's in nursing. He's getting his degree as a meteorologist. So plus we both work full time. Kids are in activities. It keeps us pretty busy. But I will say, we had some serious windage, as you guys know, in the last several weeks. And I'm happy to report that this weed fabric has held up so beautifully. I am so impressed. We, especially Justin, was really worried that it wasn't going to hold up. And it has not budged. So I'm very happy about that. 
not much update on the grapes. They're pretty much about the same. But here are, we got lots of rain, so I haven't had to water anything. But here are my red onions. They are looking good. Got red onions all down there. Some Texas sweets down here. Everything is looking so good. Look, the garlic is coming up nicely. Oh, look at that. And then down here is where I've got all the bulbs planted. And I'm just trying to see if anything has kind of came up and started to sprout yet, but I don't think so. Get, oh, yep, there's one right there. Do you see it? Let me get in between these. Right here, this one's come up to sprout. Look at this guy. Get out of my garden. <laughs> Psycho. But, yeah. So over here, you know, we were originally gonna put potatoes when we've decided to actually just do flowers because the area that is over there is, get out of there, is not gonna be big enough for potatoes. And what we have actually decided to do is to put the potatoes on the opposite end. I also did some reading and read that you don't really want to plant potatoes and onions together. We're gonna be putting potatoes down here in rows all the way across. We'll, I think we're gonna do our rows this way, I think is what we decided. And then our compost pile is gonna go here. Justin has got to go get pallets from work that we can, uh, so we'll be able to make that there. This little garden bed is still going strong. Dinosaur kale is go doing well. My cauliflower is growing, but I think it's gotten um, frost on it or something. I'm not sure, but I don't know that that's good to eat, but my kale's doing good. The bees love this in the mornings. This kale is doing good. We're actually gonna be using this for soup this week. It's not the prettiest little garden bed, but it still eats and it still does just fine. All right, well, that's it for the evening chores. I'm gonna get inside. I'm gonna get the chickens another gallon of, almost said milk, of water. And then it's cook dinner and start some seeds. So I'll have a separate video on that for you guys later this week. But otherwise, uh, thanks for hanging out with me this evening. Hope you enjoyed my quick little homestead chores. <laughs> and now I've got to go do mom chores and cook some dinner. We're having taco salad for dinner tonight. It's not the kids' favorite, but I normally cook the beans with the meat. We're gonna do them separate tonight and see if that changes their opinion of the matter. All right, guys, until next time, bye.